What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another Let's Play with Coach Gamer Dude. Today we're going to be playing Bastet, which is a uh, an assassin. So she's going to be kind of more ability based on the assassin rather than any kind of basic attack uh, damage. I mean, we, we'll do a little bit of basic attack damage in our build, but it, it's mostly going to be um, penetration and power and going things in that nature. So, um... Let's go ahead and jump in Locked here. Up, First thing that we are going to start with is going to be Heart Seeker to get that pen nice. and that high power and that passive already going for us. So, start that, get our meditation because it is a soul. Wow, they have three people out. Oh man, That's might not even be able to. Okay, okay, never mind. Here they go. They're coming back. Never mind. <clears throat> We're good. That was gonna be a problem. No problem. Not gonna be a problem. So. Bastet, she's one of one of my more favorite, more uh, more light assassin in my, uh, you know, uh, she's better in my opinion than some of the other assassins that are like, I don't know, there's some assassins that I just really can't get behind because <laughs> putting in the extra work to do this right here for them, putting on a show. But uh, she's one of my favorites because she has. On my way. Okay, don't get too close. I will jump in on you. Perfect height. Boy. That's pretty good tick damage, I would say. I mean, 71 a tick. So, yeah, she has an ability that lets her jump in and then back out. It's actually two abilities. So, you don't have to jump out, you have to click it again in order to jump out. So, um, but you have the chance to jump back out. Which gives her one of the best poke uh, ability sets out of all the assassins because she can get in and out really quick and do her tick damage. So basically we're gonna do this right here and jump right out. And I'm, I'm really bad with her ult now because they just changed her ult pretty I mean not I guess not pretty recently, but kind of recently where I hate her ult, you cannot get out of it. Um, but basically where you, back in the past it used to be more like where her circle is, where she has like, she summoned cats and then we go after them. Now it's, oh there we go, that's what we want to do is try to hit all of them with that cone attack. Our, our second ability is going to do about the most damage out of everything, especially since we're leveling it up first, so. Um, yeah, her ult used to be more like her circle where you summon cats, well I mean you throw the cat in the circle, but in... The, her ult used to be like a summon. You'd summon them out and they would chase them down, which is awesome. But they, ooh, I got that. Yes! Die at the hands of my, at the paws of Bastet. <laughs> but they changed it and uh, now it just like, deals extra damage upon, oh gosh. Got that. Here we go. So yeah, extra ability based damage, which is cool. I'm. Damn, that actually did a whole bunch of damage. I need to get better at using that. I always forget to use it before I jump in or before I need to like secure a kill or something, but damn, did it just do a whole bunch of damage. I feel like that person had a lot of health left, so just gotta hit him with everything. And we'll be good to go. So, oh gosh, that did a lot more damage than I thought. Ooh, jumped out of that, fuck you. Can't kill this cat. Not yet. Back up. Leave me alone. Damn it. Leave me alone. Oh, thanks, Emoja. You're you're a real pal. She said sorry. You're doing great. Whatever you're sorry for, you can work it out. It's all gonna be okay. Just keep telling me, bitch. Okay. Jump back. It's tear. We do really good damage even to the. Well, hell yeah, I got another kill. What is up? So yeah, you know, best that's one of the most annoying ass bitches out of all the assassins. Just jumping right in and jumping right out. You know, it's really hard to kind of counter that. You know? <clears throat> so, that's probably why she's one of my favorites. Yes, Emoja. Just keep giving us heals. I love it. Damn, I'm like all fully healed again. Go in. Come on. Damn, I missed my circle. I suck. 
Fuck you, Yana. You leave me alone. Freaking blocking me from getting that kill. Come on. Damn, you're pushed up. Aggressive ass. You really want this kill, huh? Don't you? you die for it. Yes. Dove right in. He should have dove out. What an idiot. Dumbass. He deserve every part of that death. Team's going up. Oh, he thought I was being a dick. I was not being a dick. Dog. Oh, 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 see, I'll get these kills anyway. Give me a double. Give me a triple. Give me a double. I don't know where I'm at. Was that a double? No. That was only one. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sorry, Martha. Two for one. Okay. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's let's go back and heal. I'm at 50 health, so. <laughs> Miss emojis. My best friend. Don't go anywhere, Moja. Don't leave me. I need you. Come here. Damn. Giannis didn't even have to hit us with the portal on the ground. I mean, as he shouldn't, but he still did a lot of damage. Yoja. No, no, no. No need to be sorry. You are everything. You're keeping me alive. You're... Keeping my heart beating, keeping me flowing. Love is strong. Back up, come on. You really thought you were gonna do that? That's some alright. Oh, cat. Yes! Good job, Trevor. Going in. <laughs> he deserves that. Oh, yes. Okay. Damn it. This my jump. Not gonna miss my circle this time. Get him. Yes. Rampage. Ram fucking page, bitch. Can't stop this cat. Can't stop this cat. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we probably need it. But I am gonna poke first. Damn. We do some serious damage. I love Heartseeker first. I really think I like it more than Blood Torch. I think I'm gonna have to just go Heart Seeker every single time instead of Blood Torch. I mean, both are really good. Blood Torch does give that shield. Heart Seeker is just hair. I mean, it just. Yep. Maybe. No. Maybe. Yep. Mine. Mine. Sick die. Kind of popped this a little, a little late again. I forgot about it. I've been forgetting about it a lot, but that's okay. I had my ex, she'd been dead, but now I got it, so take that, both of you. Okay, I gotta get out. Should've jumped out, but I'm actually glad that I jumped on him. And then my bestie here, Mojo, gonna heal me right up. Keep us right in, 6-0, never gonna die, as long as we just stay at the hip of you, Mojo. Come here. Yes, didn't even need that. Oh, damn, this legs. Oh, no, oh, no. Don't kill me yet. Medic, your mojo, that's you. Let's go back. Get these hills. Regroup and push back in. There's only three of us left. And me and Hunbats are both almost dead. Better back up. Back up, Persephone. You do not want this cat. Get this other healing item, and then we can go back in. Everybody group up. Your mojo, you fucking rock. Wish that was an option. Let's start poking. We will never die with this Remoja. <laughs> Gotta make sure that we're showing our appreciation and making sure that she feels appreciated. So that she keeps healing us the most. I feel like she's always just like right where we're landing. Like every time we dive in, we come back and she's right there ready to heal us. Like she knows we're gonna be fucked up when we get back because we're diving in on the entire team usually. Uh, yes! With the dive again! Hell yes! Eight no start. Forgot my ult again. You know what? That will work. I'm here. I'm gonna give this fucking Hunbats at least some kills. Nope, I'm gonna get it. Mine! Nope, not mine, okay. Hunbats after all. I was right, gonna give him the kills. That's really what I was trying to do. And that was definitely trying to kill him. Hunbats, get out of the tower, what are you doing? 
gonna die if he's definitely just trying to kill you. Oh man. Destroyed him. Damn it, if I would hit that circle. Wait. Nope. I'm back again. That was gonna be us. That monkey's still in all these cat kills. Get out of here, you fucking asshole. Leave me alone. Do not like it. Oh man, if I would have hit him with my axe, he would have been. Fuck. Probably would have died by me, but at least he still died. Either way, it doesn't really matter as long as he dies. Moja's still healing us. Yeah, I just don't think we're gonna die. I really just don't think it's gonna happen. Damn! I don't know what hit me, but that hurt! Okay, we'll stay right back here with him. Oh, no worries. We all oh no, leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! No! Wow, you aggressive ass! You dove past my entire team. Like, where are you going? What do you think you're gonna do? You're gonna die, that's what you're gonna fucking do. Okay. So, let's go. Where's Tabby, of course, and then probably... Probably the Crusher is what I'm thinking I'm gonna go. I'm just thinking if I want to build Baller's Beast, it's really great. I think I'm gonna go the Crusher. And then the Sledge, yeah. Sledge. That's a really good idea. Because... Of that extra defense when you dive in so you know every time that you get in combat with the sledge that passive will kick in and you'll get those uh, protections from both physical and magical helping you not take as much damage when you're in so it's basically what you need is defenses when you're actually surrounded by enemies that's about damn can I get him? Can I get him? Fuck you, are you serious, man? He had like 10 health, like maybe not even that. That's some bullshit. Damn, get out of here. All you gotta do is just walk forward on your shit. You're not tricking nobody. There's another one. Damn, that one got me. Never mind. Guess I talked too soon. But, yeah, the sludge is definitely a really good build. That's why I was sort of every single time in the middle on her. But, Pressure and then probably after that go into after the sudden brawler is of the healing from Aphrodite. Just want to cancel that out. And we're definitely hitting everybody with our abilities. This time I remember my ult. <laughs> there we go. Push. This could be the final push to finish the shit eight and one. If I don't even get another kill here. Come here, bitch. Nice. All right. Two left. Two left. There's one. Double kill? Yes! Double kill! You can't fucking take this cat! Alright. I think this is probably it. There's only a tier, I and mean, he's really not gonna be able to do much damage. He can try to be more of a distraction. Damn! I got him too! Up, we are shredding right now with Heartseeker and the, the Crusher. Those, both those passives on those abilities, man. I tell you what. That is just the way to fucking go every single time. I love it. Get out of here. Better run. Nope. All right. You can die too. I think this is gonna be it. Finish it. Attack that tight. Come on. Here we go. Yep. Whatever. Yes. Fucking shredded with that. Good game. That's the at the finest. Basically the easiest way to play her. So. Um, but yeah, we would have went the Sledge, uh, probably then Brawler's Beat Stick, um, then something like Hydra's and Jotun's Wrath or something, you know, get some cooldown in there. And I also like Hydra's because then basically every time that you dive in, your basic attack is ready to do a big amount of extra damage on top of that for that passive. So that's just, you know, adding extra damage on top of extra damage, which is really what we were doing with Heartseeker and the Crusher too. So let's... Go ahead and commend our team. Go over to our stats here and then I will head out. So if you guys enjoyed, give it a the video a thumbs up and then other than that, I'm out guys. Peace.